If we want to succeed in the luxury sector, if we want to succeed in the luxury tourism, it's not just about being uh, motivated by luxury itself, it's also the necessity of understanding the different tools that we have in our hand to make that luxury product more available to people. We are changing, we are changing the luxury consumer, therefore we need to know very much what that consumer wants. I chose this particular program because it allowed me the opportunity to learn from another industry, which is retail and everything in luxury. So in case you want to change careers or look into something different that you already know, this program is perfect for you. This master is perfect for those who want to start into the marketing field for luxury tourism and also for the marketing field in general. Luxury tourism. Uh, it's in a constant growth, it's in a constant steady growth and, and consistently has been even in the toughest pandemic times. The profile of the luxury consumer is also changing and this is the reality behind the luxury sector and that's the reality that we want to take in our program. I studied business administration with a diploma in fashion management. I've always had interest in marketing and because of that I choose to do this Master in Marketing for Luxury Tourism. This program is structured in two terms. Term one, which is one semester, six months, and term two that is around three months, plus the seminar and guest speakers and trips. And the first semester was a little more theoretical. It was more about learning concepts and getting to know a little bit more into the luxury industry not only in hospitality, but as well as retail, which for me was very interesting to learn. I really enjoyed experiential marketing. It was really fun and we learned a lot because it was more practical to just learn how to, to create an experience for the clients. And we like to take students outside the classroom so that they can validate what we learn in the classroom. We have guest speakers on jewelry, fashion, luxury cars, private banking, any area that we think it could be interesting for the students and their understanding of the luxury sector and the luxury needs for its customers. Second semester was uh, more intense. We had different professors uh, that are actually working in the industry. We visited a lot of companies. We visited some golf um, luxury resorts and stores like Chanel or, or Louis Vuitton. This program is composed by different semesters. Semester one and two are probably academic where you gain the knowledge needed to, to work and be immersed in the marketing sector. And that semester three is an optional internship. So if you decide to take the internship, we'll be guided you for that semester. Career Services of Bamet is in charge of helping you prepare for your internship semester. Uh, one of the main things is to get to know you more time. What is your plan? What is what you want to do? We prepare a career day where 85, 95 different companies participate and it's a chance for you to interact with the hospitality leaders. Really thanks to La Roche, I found this to go to the Ritz Carlton in South Beach. I'm going to start my internship in Barcelona in one of the IA ESG hotels. They're trying to build all the image so they will need a lot of support in the marketing area and they think that I'm gonna be a lot of help for that. One of the, um, the strengths of Le Roche is the diversity. You have people from all over the world, you can learn a lot of new cultures. The cultural awareness, uh, the different understanding of what luxury is and, and what luxury means for each of the cultures, we have that actually in the classroom itself. Uh, especially if you're into business development, I would recommend this master's for you. I had classmates that come from um, law students or with fashion industry, so we all come together into one thing that is marketing for luxury and it's amazing. 